further addition to the inside track. We have got a confirmation. Sadanand Gauda, Minister of Chemical and Fertilizer, is also being dropped from the Union Cabinet. HRD Minister Ramesh Pokhriyal Nishank has been dropped. Now we are getting to know that Sadanand Gauda also will not be inducted in the new Cabinet. Meeting is at 7 LKM. Is over. We can see leaders have been coming out from Prime Minister's residence. Which other names? That could see a promotion. Anurag Thakur, Purushottam Rupala, G. Kishan Reddy likely to be promoted to the cabinet rank. Lot of speculation, but clearly a reference of a lot of permutations and combinations that are taking place there at the Prime Minister's residence. National Affairs editor Rahul Srivastava is also now joining us. Rahul, of course, a lot of it's speculation. Anyone who knows the BJP government knows that there will be more surprises than expected results. Now, I just read a few names that were from Uttar Pradesh, Uttarakhand, women faces, other outfits, marginalized communities. How do you see this rejig as a message for the public from the government? Is it going to be only election? Is it going to look like a government with different representatives? Pooja, the government knows that its image took a beating uh, as far as uh, the second surge COVID is concerned. And also, the Prime Minister has been carrying out a sector-wise review in terms that in what sectors, which ministry and which department needs a certain degree of, of improvement. And after that, an elaborate exercise, there has also been an exercise of politically with J.P. Nadda, the BJP President, Amit Shah and others, holding political meetings uh, as far as uh, the shape and perception about the government is concerned. In that, the RSS also has played a very strong role this time around, given that UP is going to polls. And uh, in UP, the RSS is going to have an important role to play. After Rahul, that I request kind of you to just...